And they'll be in trying to break down what Carlos Corbran describes as a very competitive and combative whole City side tonight. There's Wallace down the line to Malumbi. Albion have made a bright oh. start. Malumbi into the penalty area. Wallace right hand side. Cross comes in. It's cleared away. Oh, oh, it's hit the defender. And DK tries to get on the end of it as well. And the goalkeeper, Carl Darlow, grasps the ball in the end. But it was Markle Brighton. The ball just cannoned back off him as it was crossed in by Jed Wallace. And then Daryl DK at the back post almost got to it before Darlow. Darlow was able to claw it away from underneath the crossbar. Eric Peters on the halfway line. Hull taking their time to push up here. They're happy to let Peters have it. Yep. Peters tries to clip it over the top towards Townsend. It's a good ball from oh, Peters. What a, a touch ball. from Townsend. Inside, lays it to the edge of the box. Wallace shoots. Oh. And it's a save by Darlow down low to his left-hand side. Well, Wallace met it on the stretch didn't hit it perhaps as cleanly as he would have hoped to there then Darlow grasps the ball at the second time of asking no, it's, it's come across quick Boblin he's got to strike it with his laces he goes with the instep All Brighton dangerous oh, delivery DK's what header is saved save. by Darlow DK gets to it first again and smashes it wide it takes a deflection and goes behind for a corner to West Bromwich Albion great work from All Brighton a little glance there from Daryl DK, but a big save. Big save. From Carl Darlow, the man on loan from Newcastle. Albion will settle for a corner. Yeah, you've got to credit the goalkeeper there. It's a great ball in from all Brighton. And DK does everything right. And you've got to credit the goalkeeper. It's a fantastic save. A shave forward, looking for Daryl DK. Showed too much of it to Elder, who wins the header. Nods it into Doherty. Doherty loses it. Furlong picks up the loose one. Plays it into all Brighton. Good ball from all Brighton out towards Wallace. Cleared, though, by McLaughlin. And now Tetty nods it down. He was unmarked there, Tetty. And here's Slater. Tetty, the ball comes to him on the left-hand side. Oh, would you believe it? Benjamin Tetty, with Hull City's first attempt on goal, has rifled the ball past Josh Griffiths into the top corner. What a strike from the Ghanaian. It's his first Hull City goal. And Albion have done all the work at the top end of the pitch they've had barely anything to do at the back but the Tigers take the lead well, it's Hull City 1 West Bromwich Albion nil. well I did say you know the longer you, you play like that and you, you don't score a goal that's always something that could happen it, football's a cruel game a very very cruel game they don't deserve that goal listen take nothing away from, from the actual strike it's, it's a fantastic finish and he's found the top corner you know he turns and pivots and, and drills the ball I mean Josh Griffith's got no chance but putting the ball in the net that's what wins games Albion will be absolutely gutted that they're at the very least not on level terms at this stage in the game Andy but they've still got 45 minutes ahead of them and there's still three points on offer two goals is the target now are they good enough to get them that's the question All Brighton does well plays it into the penalty area Malumbi pulls it back towards DK oh. it's a save by Darlow who pushes it away diving down low got to be a goal DK unable to beat Darlow again in this game cross comes in from Townsend DK oh, lays chest. it off to the chest and oh, oh it's Jed Wallace who swipes at the ball from the left-hand side of the six-yard box and miscues it wide. Big chance that. First for Daryl DK yeah. and then for Jed Wallace. Two huge chances. I think we rushed the first one. You know, I really do. He's got time. You know, the ball into DK is fired, isn't it, DK? He's still got to score, don't get me wrong. But, you know, just take your time. It's going to be whipped in towards What's goal. It's flicked is? on at the near post. It's 2-0 Hull City. Well, Sean McLaughlin... Is the man claiming the goal. It's his first of the season. Well, it's disastrous for Albion. They were so in control of this game without scoring. But Hull City have scored twice without reply now. And Sean McLaughlin nods in at the near post from a left-wing corner. It was whipped in towards goal. Albion stunned. They're 2-0 down in a game that they were completely dominant in, Andy. I'll tell you what, you won't see a better corner into the near post area than this. It's flat, it's got pace. It's a superb ball in. McLaughlin meets it well. And uh, Griffin's got no chance in, in goal for that. Nothing he could do with that. Got to defend it better. Got to get bodies in. You know, we just, we just can't break at the moment. Here's Malumbi out to the right-hand side. Wallace is down 
30 yards away from goal. Albion will continue. O'Shea gets the ball in towards DK. Nodded away. Swift takes it down edge of the box and Swift is brought down. Yep. Free kick to West Bromwich Albion. Great work from John Swift. This yeah. is all about John Swift here. 100%. Need a moment of magic from Albion's most technically gifted player. When I mean, you score now, you're back in the game, aren't you? There's the whistle. Big moment this in the contest. Up steps John Swift. Oh, it's up the, it's post. the post. And O'Shea swipes at goal and fires it high and wide. Wow. John Swift. So, so close to bringing Albion back into this game. But the post denies him, and it remains 2-0 to Hull City. Well, what have you got to do to score a goal? Take nothing away from Hull. Both their goals have been excellent goals. Here's Albrighton onto his left foot, in behind to Taylor Gardner-Hickman. Gardner-Hickman now to John Swift. Right-hand side of the penalty area, needs reinforcements, goes backwards to O'Shea. O'Shea to Swift. Swift has DK ahead of him. Swift will have to drive himself. Good work from Swift into the penalty area. Gardner Hickman pulls it back. It's Jed Wallace looking to turn oh. and shoot. And it's kicked away by Darlow this time. O'Shea nods it back in. Up into the air by Doherty. If it's another save it's from Darlow, this time from Jed Wallace. It is, but it's another good chance, Jez. He'll be disappointed with that. It's on his right-hand side. He kind of side-foots it again. Put your laces through it. Get some lift on the ball.